So you get the remote, and since it's in the car and you want it out of the car, you push out. First, it takes it out back. You need to have at least, I would say, five feet of clearance. So it goes out and down. That's okay, that just makes a noise. Okay, it'll lift the car a little bit. Just stick your remote back on like that. There's a bungee here, hooked to this armrest. And a bungee here, hooked onto that red handle. You don't want to move the red handle. Then you have to raise this seat because it won't go in the car if that seat's down or up. You raise this, tighten the knob. There's this red knob here to push down to unlock or the thing won't. So Now, it's a little bit bumpy, but it's kind of like going into a car wash. And you turn it off. Get off. Put the brake up. Hook this bungee to the armrest. My guess is you might have to have somebody help you do that. Hook this one around that red hook. Now, if you don't lower this, if you don't lower that, it won't fit in the car. And you gotta lower the seat, lower the arm. Get the remote now. The thing is out and you want it in. Uh, so now you gotta push it in. Because we lowered the steering wheel and we lowered the seat, we just in. keep pushing in. When it goes all the way up, now it goes into the car. Push that button. And you can show this video to anybody who's helping you you're all set